But you know who they go to? The middlemen. You know how rich the middlemen are? I'm rich. These guys blow everyone away. I don't know. Nobody even knows who the hell they are. Did you ever hear? Does anybody know a middleman? Would like to meet. Yeah, it's Biden's son. It's Hunter. Oh. It's Hunter. I'll bet you Hunter is a middleman. He's, he's collecting. He's like a vacuum cleaner. He follows his father around collecting. What a disgrace. It's a crime family. You want to know something? It's a crime family. He's following his father. Hunter Biden is a middleman. Oh, that's wild. No, these people are amazing. These middlemen. You're right. Hunter made no money until his father became vice president, and now he's like a vacuum cleaner. His father goes to Germany. Hunter's right there. Hey, give me a couple of million. Not a couple of million. A hell of a lot more than a couple of million. That's a shame. I'll tell you what, it's an organized crime family as far as I'm concerned. I capped out-of-pocket costs and the way they get protected by big tech and by the media. The media doesn't want to ask. You know, they didn't ask. This is the hottest subject there is right now. And I didn't watch Sleepy Joe last night. I just wanted to see what he looked like. He wasn't looking too good. I just couldn't watch. It was too painful. But, but you know, they didn't. I, I understand that they did not ask him a question about this. Can you believe it? Now think of it. And Stephanopoulos interviewed me two weeks ago, and it was, you know, he was nasty. He was nasty. I mean, he was tough. He was he's a tough guy. I watched last night the little stuff I watched, and what I heard, it was like uh, softballs. I mean, it was. So, but he didn't. With this is the hottest subject there is. They didn't ask him one question about their corruption in the family. They didn't ask him one question about how big tech is protecting him. Big tech is not allowing anybody. To, how about this? They took down, I guess, Kaylee, but they took, how about Kaylee? Is she great? No, but they took down. They took down her Twitter site because she had the audacity to put up an article written in the New York Post, which is one of the biggest newspapers in the country. I think it's the oldest newspaper in the country. And they put up a article and they took down her site. Can you believe what's going on in this country? And then they talk about they talk about freedom of the press. They also said last night it was very interesting. They talked about the transition, the friendly transition. Will you agree to the friendly transition? And of course the answer is yes. First of all, I don't think there's going to be a transition because we're going to win. But let's, let's hope we don't have to worry about it. No, but think of this. They get up. We demand a friendly transition. And yet we caught them spying on my campaign and trying to take down the president of the United States, right? That wasn't too friendly, right? That was too friendly. And, they, and we caught them cold. Anyway, let's get back to the medical parts of the world. This is much simpler to understand if you think about it. But I capped out of pocket costs for insulin at $35 a month. People were going, literally, they were going bankrupt over insulin, or they weren't getting the insulin, which is a terrible thing. So it's $35 a month or less. 